Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I'm playing on Ferdinand, my Animal Crossing Island. I am going to give a tour of it and then we're going to work on a build for one of my villagers' houses. So today Kix is here with us. So that's cool. That's all for now. I hope you enjoy the loveliest of lovely days. Let's go. I'm excited to show you guys around my island. We're just patiently waiting for it. Yeah. So, this is around my house. This is my house. This is my character also. And I think first we're gonna gonna show you the map very first. So, this is the map, and I have and the the back side of my island is pretty much done. So the fur around my house, but the front of my island by resident services, I'm remodeling right now. So that is not done yet. But yeah, this is my island. So I have Wolfgang. He's my birthday twin. Vivian, Sherb, Biscuit, Walker, Punchy, Shino, Mitzi, Claudia, and Whitney. Yeah, those are my villagers. There's some that I want to get rid of, like Claudia, and Sherb, and Punchy, maybe Whitney. Yeah. Later in this video, I actually Claudia asked to move out, so Claudia left. Yeah. Yeah. This is my house. Let's go and do a tour of my house. Okay, so this is the main room. Oh, there's a little bug in there. I think we named him Steve. Yeah, this is my main room with my gaming desk, a craft bench, a piano, some furniture, and then the walls are all decorated and so are this is the ceiling. So yeah, it's pretty cool. I spent a long time in my house and I, this is one of my favorite rooms in it. I love it so much. Now we're going into the guest bedroom. This is just a guest bedroom. And it, I used one of my favorite furniture sets on it. Because I thought it was really cool. And I customized it all. And that little dog in the corner. The mom's plush. It's all over my island. You will find them everywhere. If you really look hard enough. They are the cutest things ever. I love them so much. This is, this is the first this is the guest room. Now we'll move on to the next one. Next is the kitchen, I believe. So yeah, let's go to the kitchen. Oh no, Steve, no. I stepped on him. That's okay. There are a lot of bugs in my house. We'll just have Steve 2.0. Yeah, now we'll go into the, to the kitchen. So this is the kitchen. I think I might redo the kitchen. Like, I do love it, but I think I might redo it. There's froggy chairs, croppy snacks, and then just some cool furniture. I think, I think that's cool furniture. And then there's dry words up in the corner. So yeah, that's the kitchen. Yeah, now we're going to the, the bathroom. I love the bathroom. I didn't show the bathroom very well in this because I'm doing a voiceover right now. But I really like the bathroom. It's really cool. I spent a long time on it. It took me forever to get it how I liked it. So yeah, this is the bathroom. It's pretty cool. And I love the little, the new thing they added to Animal Crossing. And like, almost like, the like effects on different items. Yeah, this is me. So I didn't think there was any music playing, but there was. There was music playing. Yeah, that's the bathroom. And now I believe we're gonna go upstairs to my to my bedroom. Uh, yeah, I think we're going upstairs. Yes, we are. This is my bedroom. It's my one of my. It's my actual favorite room in this house. I love it so much. Here it is, the bed. 
the bed is like my favorite kind of furniture set i can't remember what it's called though and there's like clay and there's orange juice and then a little desk it's pretty cool oh there i go stepping on another bug it's okay and the walls are covered in sanrio posters because i love sanrio so much yeah let's go i think we're going to the basement now which is the art room that's gonna be cool because it irl i love art so I wanted to have a room dedicated towards art in my Animal Crossing. Oh, here it is. It's my art room. There's a bunch of like painting and sewing and puzzles. And there's a bunch of dry voids and picture frames in this room. And books. And I used the butterfly wallpaper because I really like the butterfly wallpaper. I think it's really cool. Oh yeah, this is it. It would be, I might change this room up a little bit. I have a lot of plans for this island, so subscribe so you can see when I post new videos or go live. Cause I try to go live three to four times a week. So just check it out. But yeah, now we're doing my island. Around my house right here, it's not finished yet. I'm still working on decorating it. It's like my my island is almost like a forest fairy core and the front of it is like back alley kind of vibes. Like like a ghetto but not a ghetto. But yeah. This is around my house. I have a rock circle, which I am incredibly proud of. It took me way too long to get that. And as you can see in the corner, there are a bunch of flowers on the beaches because I'm always too scared to sell my flowers because I'm worried I'm going to need them. But I never end up using them, so it's great. And I have just have like a bunch of little nature items along the pathway. And the retro transportation system stall up there, I use that all over my island. Especially I've been using a lot in the front where I'm doing like the ghetto, like building little houses out of it. But right here, it's not finished because as you can see in the corner right there. I need to finish that. I do have a little dog park right there and I love it so much. I think it was one of the very first things I put on my island and I haven't really changed it because I love it so much. Up there on that island is the campsite, but it's not, I can clearly see it's covered in flowers, bushes and weeds. And over here is like a drive-in movie theater. I need to add a few finishing touches to it. But I really do. I love it. And then, yeah, so I want to make a new, like, parking lot lines to put in it. Because that'd be cool. And I have a little lake right there that we were first at. And then this is another little pathway. It's, like, ruined stuff. And that's, like, a, this is, like, a boardwalk back here. It's, like, overlooks with, like, little things. And there's Kurobi snacks and more ruined. And then another croppy thing. And then down here is my mystery island. Please ignore the random custom design right there. I need to remove that. I changed my custom design recently. But across the bridge is finished, except for by the museum. You'll see that. But over here is finished. It's like a very like foresty fairies, kind of. And I have a little mushroom table right here. It's a little duck sitting down eating some ramen and over here i have like a mushroom circle with a croppy snack a croppy snack in the middle it's beautiful and then up here i have a painting set which i think is amazing and then the lily of the valley because i do have five stars it's honestly kind of surprising sometimes but yeah over here is just oh up here is where the museum is i need to do a, i want to do a video of redecorating the museum so i'll have to do that or i'll do it in a live stream one time be cool and over here there's a giant teddy bear oh i love them their little faces are the cutest things ever Adorable. and there's a hay field with a bench and a windmill in the middle of the hay field and then up here is a waterfall like a water terraforming that i did and i really like it i think it's really cool And there's a bunch of flowers, and I love the butterfly. I forgot, I forgot like the butterflies. 
And then over here is a heart lake. It was naturally spawning, as you can see. It was it like a naturally spawned. And I didn't want to do anything with it, so I just left it. Because a lot of my island I terraform, especially the water. But this was just naturally spawning, so I left it. Because I thought it was really cool. Yeah. As you and you can also see the um waterfall that I terraformed right next to it. It's cool. Yeah, there's a moon right in right at the top of the heart. And then there's just a pathway that goes all the way around. With like a little bike. And then there's a ruined arch right here. And then down here is like my farm area. So I have all the crops. And there's a little cashier. It's a little dog. He's adorable. Cutest little guy. But there is a lot of crops over here. I have every single crop. And it's nice to have. Just like... And then all of the different fruits I have. I didn't mean to do that, but then, as you can see, Nook's Cranny and the Able Sisters are down here. And also, my pier is down here too. Right off screen a little, my pier is just right there. So, yeah. And I meant to go in and show you guys the custom designs I did, but I'm wearing the sweater I'm wearing right now. It's a custom design that I did, but more crops over here and a little like stall market stall where I have some vegetables yeah. so now I'm going back up I'm gonna go so this right here is a gyroid forest as you can see there's a bunch of little gyroids oh and I think this I this is where I was talking about what villagers I wanted to have leave something i don't remember what i was doing but yeah and then over here there's more gyroids up i have a little picnic blanket over here which i actually love it's the cutest thing ever i saw it on pinterest and i'm like i have to do that so i i did it to my idea from pinterest i changed it a little but i really like that and this right here is sherb's house and then claudia's house but she's leaving so i'm gonna do a villager hunt and pick it a different villager. Yeah, those are their houses. And then I have a little swing right there, and a bunch of flowers, and a little duck, and a puddle of water. And then going back to the dry wood forest, just so you can look at the dry wood too and can see them. And then over here is where the runs and services. I'll go back home. over there is where the resident to your right is resident services past the bridge and over there I'm not it's still on major construction it's like or remodeling so it's like not very done but we'll go up here first so there's Claudia fishing I've done most of the roads I just used to add items so here's resident services with kids and then down here is where we start. I, I'm done with this area. I just noticed me and Biscuit are wearing matching sweaters. Oh, that's the cutest thing. But this is the little like, alley kind of way. And so, yeah, I have like houses and there's like a fish market over here. And I really liked that idea. And I think I'm gonna move like Wolfgang's house over here. So I feel like he fits the vibe. And then over, over there on my little, where my, I'm gonna, I want to do something right there. My brain isn't working. I want to do something right there. And then, oh look, sure. But yeah, and then that's Biscuit's house right there. Yeah, I talked to Sherp and I took like me like 20 minutes, so I just cut that out. But there's Biscuit's house right there. And then over here, over there is Wolfgang's house. And then she knows house. And that is Mitzi, Mitzi's house. And up on the top, there's Punchy on the right. And it's on the left. To see their house. Who is it? It's, um, it's the other wolf. It's not Whitney, it's the other one. Oh my goodness, what is her name? It's gonna bother me now, but. 
so it's like the gist of my island i didn't show you two people's houses but i've been doing all working on that area i'm gonna turn it into a video so you'll see it then but, and i'm gonna work on the resin services to see how many stars i have let's see there's isabel she looks so cute in her little sweater Five stars, let's go. Awesome. I've got s real such feelings. Oh, that's funny, that's funny. <laughs> got a perfect score again, yay. Just let me know next time you'd like to hear the latest feedback. Thank you, Isabel, very helpful, very cute. Yeah, I do have my old dream address for my island before I re remodeled it. I might put that in the description of this video. You can go check it out. Short of some time. But yeah. That's mostly this, my tour. So now I'm going to work on Biscuit's house. So here I am doing some of the path, path, paths. I had a lot of fun with this. With building, it takes me a while to get like into the groove of things, but then once I get in the groove of things, oh, I can do so much so quickly. Yeah, I was just doing the path around Wolfgang's and Biscuit's house. But, yeah, I... When I stopped for a minute, that means I'm thinking I did this on stream, so I was also talking to people to the chat too, so I don't know. Yeah, tonight I think I'm gonna start. I think I might start a new like video series. I'm, I'm trying to decide, I'm trying to decide or not. Yeah. But I do stream. I do stream every Friday with Nerd Campo and Metal Gear. So Watch it every Friday at like 9, usually 9 mountain time. Oh, it's here. We stream. Play fun games like Lethal Company. Yesterday, today's Saturday. Saturday. Yesterday we were playing Who's Your Daddy. Very intense. And I think on Friday, this Friday, we might be doing another Le the Lethal Company video. So that's going to be fun. That's going to be fun. Yeah, let me know in the comments what videos you would like to see from me. Because I have so many, I want some ideas and want to know what you guys would like to watch. So that'd be, that'd be fun. Yeah, I might also do a video of KK, of Villager Hunting since Claudia just left. You'll see it in a few minutes. Leave, but I've been trying to get her to leave for months. Not because, like, she's really cute. I like Claudia, but. It was time for a new change, a new villager. Here I am, I'm just doing some uh, work on the path. And so I did this with Wolfgang's house too, just around it, but I, I cut that out because it took me forever. So I just did the same thing, covered, surrounded the house in paths. Yes, see here is Claudia asking me to leave. Oh my goodness. Finally. I have been trying to get Claudia from to leave forever. Forever. I can tell you. Yes. Change can be good. She, she's cute, but she's just... Yeah, so there was that. And I'll see here past me talking but here i am working on this house i'm doing like a little like ice cream shop kind of vibe and I, most of the stuff i did on stream with it i didn't like sorry i had to go quiet because claudia was singing her little heart out but most of the stuff i did during stream i didn't like so later than today you'll see that it's a different day it's actually earlier today i redid it and i like it a lot better now 
I was trying to, I wanted to use a little bug since he's like, Biscuit's a lazy villager and they love bugs. So I'm trying to get, incorporate a bug into the build. And here's me getting a tree. And then the sign, this is a different day. It's Saturday, February 3rd. So here me, here I am taking everything down. Trying to figure out what I want to do with it. And this part isn't sped up because the last one was because this is how I left it. This is how it still is right now. But I do really like it. I did not leave that balloon there. Don't worry. I moved that. Not that I even used it, but he ended up using my build. Here I am just trying to figure out how I want to get everything laid out. It takes me quite a while to figure out how I, wrote it. I want everything laid out. And then once it's laid out, I'm usually pretty fast at getting it finished. And I'm pretty sure I also removed the cotton candy by the end of it. I didn't end up using like the cotton candy stall. I ended up adding like two more ice cream stalls to it. My favorite thing about the um, balloon wagon is the little dog. Like, look at it. It's the cutest thing ever. I wish they would just like sell like the balloons. Like you could just get the balloons from the balloon stall separately. And you could just hold a little dog balloon. That would be the cutest thing ever. Yeah. All right, I'm putting the iron table down. And the iron table, I didn't end up liking that. There's little Mitzi. She's walking around. They're, all my villagers are so, they're, all the villagers are so cute when they wear hats. Like it's the cutest thing ever. I love it so much. Ignore the, the, just the present over there. I've been trying to get the golden slingshot because I have, I want to try to get all the golden tools, but I don't want to get them from like Mr. Islands when I get them naturally. So I've been trying to do that, but it's been taking quite a while because I need to also work on my museum, get my museum finished, but it's not finished yet. So here I am just Trying to decide what I want to do. I cut a lot out. Like a lot. Because there were times where I just wander around for like five minutes trying to think of what to do. There's a little ice cream cone. I don't like how little the ice cream cones are though. I don't like that. And I finally decided I wanted to put everything, make everything back there like, almost like garbage, but like needs to be thrown away. There's a little Sherp. What is he doing? He's the cutest little guy. He's been on every single... So, on my very first island, he was one of the ones that... Or one of the ones that moved in. After he put, like, the three plots down and stuff. And then he did the same for this island. And for both islands. So I think it's time for me to part ways with him. It's been, like, four years now. Almost four years. Where's that? I still wasn't happy with it. As you could tell, I was walking around. I'm like, mm, I don't know about this. I don't know how I feel about this. So then I tried this. I was not given, getting rid of the little flamingo guy. I may have picked him up, but I put him back. Don't worry. He's in the final build. Because I always like to have little animals, like, in charge, like, in charge of putting every, like, in charge of like the ice cream skin, like I keep, I keep saying like it's driving me insane. In charge of the vegetable stuff too. Oh, it's the cutest, the cutest. Here I am still. I'm trying to get him to move over. That's what I'm doing. That's what I remember now. And those are all stomping around. Yeah, I don't, I think, I'm pretty sure I couldn't even, I went to go talk to Whitney to see what was wrong. And she's like, oh, Charlie, I haven't talked to you in six months. I was like, oh, never mind. Never mind. So try and decide. Oh, here I'm getting the balloon. We're getting on the golden slingshot. 
Oh yeah, and it was just a covered table. I couldn't remember what it was, but then as soon as I saw it, I'm like, oh yeah, I remember now. Oh, I also hit my butt. Store broken on it. I decided to move them, put something where the flamingo is. I put the flamingo in the corner. I am trying to get them all figured out. I feel like they could have had like a better way of moving items around in the animal in this game, but hey, I'm not complaining. This game was pretty peak. I'm just sad that they stopped updating it so quickly after they released it. See, then I got another retro ice cream case. I was trying to decide where I wanted to put it. I didn't like it next to it, so then I tried just an ice cream case, an ice cream display. And I, do, I did like the ice cream display, but I didn't like it next to the retro ice cream case. So then I ended up moving that as well. I didn't know this biscuit was home. He's probably like, what are you doing out there? Yeah. Oh yeah, I was like, what am I doing? I'm moving the chairs up so I have more space to work. But yeah, I put the Got your ice cream case back there, and then it didn't fit, and then I just scoop everything up. But I hope you all had an amazing day, or are having an amazing day. Yeah, just working on it. I like the snow in Animal Crossing, but I only like it when like snows like this. But it's almost cherry blossom season and festival, and I'm excited for that. You know, first of all, you guys know all the most Super Bowl, right? I don't care about the Super Bowl. The Puppy Bowl happens before the Super Bowl. Super Bowl, I watch it every single year. Last year, Pickle, the little puppy, he was my favorite. I think his team won. Oh, he was the cutest little guy ever. Loved him. Yeah, so while we're, while we're, while my brothers are all waiting for the Super Bowl, I'm over there watching Pickle. Absolutely annihilate everybody. Greatest little boy ever. Little pickle. Yeah, I'm excited for this year. It's in a week from tomorrow. Oh, I'm excited. And I think... I think another video series I want to do is... Doing Pokemon Violet. I finished the game. I finished the Pokédex. I just finished it actually. And I think I wanted to do playing po beating Pokémon Violet using only shiny Pokémon. Cuz that sounds so fun, honestly. And doing playing Zelda. I want to do both of those. And playing Stardew Valley too. There's a lot, there's a lot of games I want to do. Here I am finally getting it. Into the, how I want it to look. So this is how I left it. It's an ice cream display. And then the retro ice cream cases. I had a lot of fun with this build. Even though it took me a while, I had a lot of fun. So I've been wanting to do my neighbor, like, the villagers' houses. I have neglected those them poor little guys forever. I finally did it. But I also need to finish my island, too, so maybe. Here I am adding the last few finishing touches to it. Like the soft stir survey. It does me looking to see if I like it right there. But then I said no, I didn't. So then I moved it over to the other side and I liked that a lot better. So then I kept that. And then I also placed the bubble gum machine. 
candy machine, the bubble gum machine. I passed it. Oh, this is hard to watch. It's front. <clears throat> passed it again. Okay. Oh my goodness. I know. That was hard to watch. <laughs> but here's that. And then. And then I'm gonna move, I'm moving the table over because I felt like it was in the way a little. And then shirt wouldn't move. There it, there it goes, he moved. He's so cute with his little hat on, I love it. I liked that there. And then I went over where Sherp is. I'm pretty sure I went over there next. Or I changed that to a I don't. What am I doing? Oh yeah, I'm doing custom designs. That's what I'm doing now. I clearly am watching this with you guys. I don't know what's going on until it starts happening. I finish fixing the custom designs right here. Oh no, Whitney's here. No, that's not Whitney. That's Vivian. I think it's Vivian. I'm putting a cardboard box right there. And I put a work for, I was gonna put a little bug on it, but then I decided I didn't like the bug on it, so then I put the bug behind it. But you'll see, you'll see. Because I'm like, it's, this gets a lazy build, villagers. Lazy villagers love bugs. They talk about the bugs on their floors all the time. I have to give him one. So then here you can see me moving the tires over and then putting him behind the cardboard box. So here he is. You can barely see him in the back, but he's right there. And I'm just doing some of the last finishing touches. Put in his higher toy right there. And then... And then I'm gonna change the ice cream cone on the table to a bunny day candy. I love the bunny day candy item. It's so cute, the little chocolate bunny. Cutest thing ever. I actually showed it off. But yeah, that's like about the video. That's the video. I spent. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed coming with me while we toured my island and did a build. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to like and subscribe. If you enjoyed the video and want to see more content like this. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. -bye.